basically what we are, we're sat on a boat called Spirit of Mystery at the moment and um, we've built this to celebrate a voyage made in 1854 by seven Cornishmen who sailed from Newlyn to Melbourne in search of the gold rush. It's the most incredible voyage and we, we were just inspired by it. About four weeks time we'll go to Newlyn, um, wait for the wind to go north, put the sails up and then go and follow in their wake. And there's lots of elements to the project. One of them is a, a big education program. And the reason we're here now under the National Maritime Museum in Falmouth is we launched it on Monday, and over a 10-day period, we have 1,800 kids passing through. So it's a really frantic, but busy time. You can see all the kids. It's great, these little shiny faces and bright eyes. And, of course, one of the modules is to actually come through the boat itself and meet one of the crew and touch it, and uh, it's fantastic. I mean, the questions you get are amazing. This is actually a really big challenge and um, we are going into the Southern Ocean in this little 37 foot boat uh, and the moment of truth really is leaving Cape Town to go into the Southern Ocean so if you backtrack from there we started 10 months ago designing, we, we, I have a policy of never going into the Southern Ocean unless we've built the boat ourselves so Chris Reese who built the boat is fantastic, I've seen it every nut and bolt, it's everything that I'd hoped for and an awful lot more on top. I mean, it's beautiful down below. Um, it's very strong, it's very safe. Um, I mean, it's evolved over hundreds of years, so it's really good fun to sail, and actually quite a good tone of speed. I've been pleasantly surprised. Just can't wait, yeah, can't wait to run away, put the sails up and have some fun. I mean, that's why we do these things.